Steve Balson here for St. Thomas Aquinas College Athletics. We're in Spartan Gymnasium Aquinas Hall, and right now joined by St. Thomas Aquinas star forward Justin Reyes. Uh, Justin, uh, as one of the other players who's been a foundation of this program over the last few seasons, uh, talk about what the ride has been like for you coming into this year. Coming in as a red shirt, uh, I, I knew I had to work hard, but I knew I wasn't playing, so it was a different experience for me than it was for Chaz and Aaron and the guys I came in with originally but I still came in every practice and coach made it a point that I had to get better every day and every workout and every lift I still had to get better even though I'm not playing because it'll pay off eventually. As you've progressed from when you when you were able to suit up and were able to be on the team how much how much pressure how much expectations have been put on you to meet your full potential clearly you're an exceptional athlete uh, how much did the coaches and your teammates push you throughout your career? They pushed me the most I've ever been pushed in my life coming here and academically just as much as on the court and you know in the weight room they push me in different ways that make me stronger mentally and that's what it's all about the mentality you come in t to practice with and into class with. And on the subject of that mentality, two seasons ago, the Spartans lost in the East Coast Conference Tournament Final. Last year, you got that win under your belt down in our nation's capital, District of Columbia. Talk us through that moment. What was that like for you guys to get on the court with the banner and, and finally get over that bump? It was great. I mean, three years going to the championship game and, and you know, the first two not achieving what we set out to in the beginning of the season, you know, it, it finally paid off and we finally got it. So we were all overwhelmed with joy. And of course, that joy continued into the NCAA tournament, the first time Stacks program has made it in the Division II era. A thrilling first round victory over Southern Connecticut. Uh, the team clearly made tremendous strides last year. Bring us from your mindset to the end of that tournament last year into the start of this season. What has this offseason been like and what's your mentality transitioning from that success into this new year? I mean, after seeing what we did last year and, you know, analyzing our season and what we did and what we set out to achieve in the beginning, we just wiped off the slate and said, look, next year we got to do even better and we got to come back even stronger and we got to pick up where we left off. And that's what we did. Well, as you enter this year, obviously uh, you were, have been named a preseason All-American, which is uh, clearly a major accolade for you. The team has been ranked number two in the nation in a preseason poll at the Division II level. Uh, talk us through what your expectations are for the year. Is, is it a game-to-game -game thing, or do you have that, that big-picture view of, uh, of having a big accomplishment at the end of the season? We've always made it a day-by-day -day thing. Coach says you got to come in each day and get better. You don't get better you know, in a month. You don't get better in a week, get better in a day, in a workout, in a practice, in a lift. Well, Justin, certainly you have gotten better over the course of your career here. We know there are going to be great things to come for you and your Spartan teammates. I want to wish you all the best in the year to come. Thank you so much. Justin Reyes of the St. Thomas Aquinas College men's basketball team. For St. Thomas Aquinas College Athletics, I'm Steve Balson.